I just had to, I just had to poke fun at LTG in that, but this will have something to do with fighting games all around too. We're gonna to be talking about the City NT mains. <laughs> Sorry about that. I can't. Okay, I'll stop laughing. I'll stop laughing. So we're gonna be looking at the main stuff. Okay. So let's talk about final the City of mains. Now the main whoever mains knocked this. Is mainly a rush down. I could pin opponents to the wall, hit them with ward strike, and plan on doing it. Pretty much, they're just pretty much an easy pace character anyone can use. So if you're looking for something easy and you like, the, and you're a fan of the new Final Fantasy, the only reason why you got into Final Fantasy in the first place is because of 15, and you're just new to the to the task, then that's what you. That's what a Noctis main is. So let's get to. Um, so, I guess maybe I don't have to do it with the phone. You know what? Because it's just one thing. <laughs> okay, now let's get to even some of the deplorables. Kefka mains are usually fans of the Joker off Batman. Because they like the characteristics of the Joker. And they fantasize about being Joker every day, all day. And they think that they're the Christopher Nolan Dark Knight Joker. So, what they would do is play Kefka, spam troll just to watch people go into turmoil from all the chaos that they cause they love chaos and they love to see people get mad enough to cause chaos so what they do is they'll end up playing a spam character like kefka but also they play him just because he's an evil clown that loves chaos because it reminds them of the joker and in their mind that they they think that the joker or there must be injustice to Joker mains that play Kefka. So if you're a Kefka player, you're a fucking deplorable. Just go, I'm just gonna put it there. If you're a Kefka main, you're a deplorable. Now there are good Kefka main. Number uh, another another main Lightning. Don't even now. Some there are some good Lightning main to know how to play her character right. But we're talking about the bad ones. That's when you need to stop playing the game and do something else. Cause we know. How much you like the spam razor gaze because you think that you're hot shit and you're good. The other main, Bart's Clauser, you know what you're doing. You're actually a pro player. You actually looked at the tier list. And you actually know that Bart's has more abilities. Even though he doesn't look like he's a tough or serious character. You know that Bart's Clauser, you know that Bart's Clauser is a pro character so you know what you're doing you're a pro you're a veteran sephiroth mains sephiroth mains have more of an ideological perspective and think the world's shit but also they're also smart high tactician fighters they mostly like to you know um trap their opponents in by running away, looking like they run away, just to trap their enemies in, and then do heavy strikes and finish them off. Also, they like to tease their opponents into thinking that they got the upper hand, but instead, it's really the Sephiroth main who got the upper hand. Plus, they think the long katana is is like the coolest thing, and most Sephiroth mains are big Final Fantasy fa seven fans. And think that Sephiroth is the best Final Fantasy villain slash video game villain ever. So most Sephiroth mains, you know, are mostly huge biased Final Fantasy 7 fans. Not to mention, you know, but they're tactical and they think they have critical thinking skills. In order to play Sephiroth, you have to have a critical thinking skill to play Sephiroth, you know. 
Cloud mains. Same thing with the Sephiroth mains. Mostly like Final Fantasy 7. They Cloud's the biggest and best hero of any Final Fantasy game. And also is tactful, but more on the emotional the more on the emotional, you know, have pretty much what you call a chip on your shoulder type of personality who usually plays Cloud. You relate to Cloud because he, you relate to Cloud because his personality is like yours. You have a chip on your shoulder and you don't want nobody else to know, so you don't tell everybody about it. You just hold it in. Squall mains are tactical alpha male type leaders. You know, they're think like a tactician. They know how to lead. They know how to run things properly. They know how to do things properly. And they and they recognize there's more Final Fantasy games than seven. So if you're Squall main, that's pretty much what you your your belief system is. And you know, actually, there's nothing really bad about Squall mains, except that you might have a little bit of social awkwardness. But you pretty much put it into good use to actually help you do better. So you know, but nonetheless, you like the fact he's faster he's a faster character base not to mention you think the gun blade is a badass weapon so let's get into um let's get into x death x death you really like the fact that he's not uh he's not even though he's a top tier character and you know it but also you play him because he never gets played and he never gets any representation in any Final Fantasy games as much as you think he should. And, you know, it's hard for you to let go of the SNES titles for Final Fantasy 5, you know, as well. Meaning you'd like 5, but most likely you want x Death to get representation. Now, Titus means you're really happy-go-lucky, but... Just like Titus main, just like Titus, you got a bit of a father issues. Just to say a little bit, you do if you're Titus main. Just saying, you got some of that. You relate to him, you know, or you played Final Fantasy X and it was your first Final Fantasy game, so that could also be it too. Kuja, you really are super flamboyant. You want people to know how much flamboyant skills you have. Flamboyantly like to play with Kuja's marksman abilities. You like his abilities, but also you got a little bit of flamboyantness. And you think he's fabulous and you wish you could be like him. Pretty much so. You know. And you like looking at yourself in a mirror a whole bunch of time. You like Johnny Bravo in that one episode where he dials 911 calls the police on himself because he says there's a handsome guy in the mirror. You're one of those, but kind of on the fruitier side. So, uh, Jack, if you're a Jack man, you're uber masculine. You're about the bros. You're like Jason Momoa. You like to lift. You, you like to lift 255 pounds and more. Nothing less, nothing more. You, I mean, nothing less, but a lot more. You like to eat burgers, lift weights, watch action movies. You know, cuss, drink a lot, be about the bros, joke around with the bros, have stupid jokes, pick up you pick up hoes from the bars, you know, manly stuff, you know, and you, and you get mad and offend and defensive when people uh, say that you're not manly enough, so you go out of your way to prove it. That's what Jack mains are, and you know, and you like Chuck Norris because he sounds like Chuck Norris. Well, it looks like Vincent Valentine f did the fusion dance with Chuck Norris. So, you like Jack based off of the fact that he reminds you of Chuck Norris. Um, let's see. What else mains is there? Um, the Emperor, you're basic. You're a basic player. You don't, you're a noob. You play the Emperor, you're, 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 you're kind of noobish because he's actually the last, less... He, he's actually the less player you should be able to use. It's on the worst. It's on the lowest tier list. For good reasons. He gets hit by vanguards pretty heavy, which fucks it up for the character. He also, you know, 
He's also only marksman ability, so he only does marksman stuff. So you know, you only like him because of the because how cool he looks. But that's the only thing going for uh, the emperor. Garland mains. Garland mains. You love the battle a whole lot. Also, if you're a Garland main, you pretty much like to play a lot of Dark Souls, Bloodborne, Demon Souls, and all those type of games. Because you like the armor in those games, you pick Garland based off of that. Or you're a big fan of Christopher Sabat as a voice actor, so you want to prove how big of a, how big of a fan by playing his the character he voiced. So it's either that, or you play a lot of Dark Souls, Demon Souls, and games like that and that's what got you into this game is because there's a character that looks like something from your your precious demon souls and dark souls so pretty much yeah garland mains are pretty much you know fit that stereotype ace mains should i go on how much you just like to fuck people's lives up you like the one shot people because you think that's going to get you in ranked terms. You think that's going to get you in the term. The minute they ban Ace. You end up throwing a bitch fit. You end up throwing a bitch fit. But the good qualities at least. You like Type 0 as your favorite game. But not only you like Type 0 as your favorite game. You think you talk about the how big the death count of the Militessen Empire outdoes every other Final Fantasy villain's death count and that they're the best villains. You think that the Militest Empire the, have the best villains as well. Also, you really like the Fabla Crystal Stovey, especially if you use them in a conjunction between Noctis and Lightning, you know, on their team. So you like that kind of dynamic. So let's get to the next one, shall we? Um, let's get to the next one. Um, Zidane. Um, you do anything for females. You want female attention if you're Zidane main. You really want to press females, so you show off in front of females. You don't show off on regular online lobbies, but when you go to an eSport bar that plays the city for tournaments or something like that, or any place there, and you see girls there, you, you play as him just to show how good you are, just to get them... To go out with you. Most Zidane fam, most Zidane mains are pretty much trying to get the girl. It's all about getting that, getting the girl. You know, you have the same demeanor, but also you want to make sure the chick in the esport bar see how good your skills is. You're adamant about getting that number by showing off. So, um, what else? Uh, what else does your um, the city of Maine says about you? Gobez, you really Gobez. You're really not a bad guy, but people think you come off as one. You know, they think you come off as one because you look intimidating, and you, but you have a you you have a you really you really have a good you really you you have a soul and heart. You pet kittens a lot, and you're all soft, but people see you as a hard dude, a hard dude in the streets. So you pick a character like Golbez, who has a lot more than just intimidation. Plus, you're a fan of Darth Vader, so there's that. Um, let's see. Von Main. You love Final Fantasy XII. But because you love Final Fantasy XII, you're a big Star Wars fan. Because it pretty much plays kind of a similar story on that, just a little bit. You love Star Wars a lot. You can't let go of Star Wars. Star Wars is all you talk about. So, you know, you pick Vaughn because he's the the, the poster boy. But also you pick Vaughn because you know he's good. And you know he's on the tier list as well. So, I think that's pretty much what I... I can't cover every single character. So, may the crystal be with you. Those are all the characters I was physically, possibly able to cover in the 15 minute second so I'm, I'm not going to cover all mains just comment your main below and I'll tell you what your main is if it's not on this video so I'm going to crystal